anaitwa Grace Ngendo Kaniu wa Ndegwa ambaye ni mtoto wa kwanza wa Godfrey Ndegwa Kariuki. Hii shamba ilinunuliwa kitambo mimi nimeishi hapa miaka 49. 49. Unaona huyu mtoto Ndegwa huyu ambaye nimeita guka yake. Ya? Yeah? Nimemuza hapa, niliingia hapa 1974, first of June. Ya? Yeah? June moja, 1974. Nilitoka kwa harusi, tukakuja hapa. Tangu hiyo siku, hatujawa hitoka hapa. Guka amekuja, amekuja, 1995 ndiyo ametuacha. Sasa, muniambie, watu wakiachiwa mali yao. Kwani mtoto baba mzee akitafuta vitu yake si anatafutia watoto wake na alafu kuna hakika kuna 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 ukweli mtu atoke na huko akuje kusema ati shamba ni yake hiyo mimi sijawahi sikia mahali sijawahi sikia watu wamekuwa wakikuja ati wanasema wanataka kuangalia wanauliza kama shamba inauzwa tunawaambia eh shamba ni ya familia na haiuzwi haiuzwi inafika tunangoja mambo ifike tugawe kila mtu apate share yake sasa hii at, hii mwaka tu ndio hao watu wamejitokelezea ati wanasema shamba ni yao waliipata ni 2013 2013 Na shamba ilinunuliwa 1972. 1972. Mimi nikaoleka 1974. Ile kitu nilipata hapa ni mbuzi na ngombe ambao mbuzea alikuwa nalisha wapi? Hapa. Na yaka niambia, enda huko wewe ndo unaenda huko kuangalia hiyo mali. Tangu hiyo siku mimi sijawa hitoka hapa. Paka mbuzea wangu ameaga 2018 April. Alipo haga ndiyo tunaona watu hapa. Kila wakati. Kila wakati. Sasa tunashindua. Uyu mwenye anasema shamba ilikuwa yake. Ilikuwa yake kivipi. Akisema amewachiwa na mzungu. Ni mzungu gani huyu. Na haleti barua ya kuonyesha. Huyu mzungu ndia ameniwachia. Atujahi mwona. Tunaona tu jina ya kampuni. Kampuni yenyewe. Haijulikani mwenyewe. Kuna haki kweli. Kuna haki kweli na tunaomba. Tunaomba. Serikali tusimamie venye wanasimamia hata wale wengine. Kwa sababu mimi siwezi kuwa nimefanya kazi na toa jasho yangu na jinyima nikitafutia watoto wangu. Alafu mtu mwingine atoka na huko akuja kuwafukuza. Inawezekana kweli? Iwezekani. Hii shamba ni ya baba yetu. Ili nunuliwa 1971, 72. Na kuna watu kama huyu, let me show you. This guy was born in this land. And now he is over 50 years. He is over 50 years. We have all the necessary papers. Now some people don't know where they are coming from. Nowhere, wanaskuja kuklaim shamba ni yao. They have been coming here, destroying our properties. If you look at this building here, I'm building. How and you are mea, wame kuja usiku satisa usiku leo, wakaibomoa. Out of nowhere. They claim they have a title. We don't know where it came from. I understand there is somebody at uh, a register known as Getich who signed that, uh, that letter, that I mean that uh, such. I don't know what is happening here in current. Maybe what is happening in the current? Maybe what is happening in the current? They are going to current searching for any in the current. Sasa ndiyo wadipata hapa wakawana kama Iran ni idol. We have got all the necessary papers here with us. Na itaonyesha mendi ya yote. We got all the necessary papers. Yeah, they are here with us. Maybe kuna association ninyo mna kuanga nao hapa na pia nuwa mna angazia kia tuzi. How? 
Yeah, there is a current community ambayo wanajua habari sana hii mashamba. I'd like even to engage the chairman of this current property. Ajui anajua kila mtu the owners of the land. Now these people don't know where they are coming from. They come in and destroy property. Afanye mtu akija kununua shamba current nafanya due diligence search na everything nafanya asikuja kununua shamba to out of nowhere. Yes. Na tena unaweza kuingia within the community's neighborhood unauliza habari hiyo shamba. Yeah, the history of that land. Yeah. And I have a history of this land here with us. If you can look here, vile ilianza tangu wakati ya ukoloni. I think you will see it here. Paka pahari tulifika dio tukaa ikakuwa yetu ikakuwa ya baba yangu. We have all the history how it has come and changed hands. Imekuja ikipadisha mkono kutoka kwa mzungu huyu kwa mzungu huyu kwa mzungu paka kwetu sasa sisi. There's a got a very nice history. Isha mba inunua na baba yangu 1972. Pasu pasu ya kwanza ilikuwa ika 10. 1976 akanunua pasu ingine erfu a a eka 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 tisa i 9.9 eh 9.9 eka 9 eka sasa ile alituzia shamba ya mwisho alikuwa alinun uh, roya anaitwa anaitwa Morgan alikuwa anafanya na Capran Capran Advocates Company maybe ya watu na wanajitokeza kuwavamia mnajua ni watu mnafahamu ama Hatu wafahamu na kini tuanjua ni wakona kabu ni naito Ivory Concepts, Concepts Limited. Hawaja jitokesha na kini wanatuma goons wakuja tu atu attack. Ivory Concepts waliada kotini wakikiri mshabani yao. Na sisi tuka 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 andika kukubinga yu maneno. Na yu kesi yuko kotini na itakua determined that first October this year. This 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 year, Tuesday this month. Yes, we'll see. Our colleagues are going to be there.